guys, welcome back to a brand new video. You're watching my channel, it's me, Cece, and today I'm gonna be showing you my fidget collection. And before we get started, make sure to like this video, subscribe, and turn on that notification bell so you know whenever I post a new video. And also, go follow me on Instagram at Enchanted Forest Slimery. You can also find me on Pop Jam at Enchanted Forest Slimery, and on my main account, Dojas for Life 1936. So, without further ado, let's get started. So first, I'm going to show you my Tangles. I have three. I have this really cute little colorful one. It's just, like, it's really just the primary colors. Next, I have the Slime Tangle. It has really nice texture on it, too. And then we have the rainbow tangle, which it's kind of glittery. I'm not sure if you can see, but it's a little bit glittery. It's really cute. And next we have my fidget pad. And it also, it has a joystick, two buttons that make noise, and two that pretty much don't. And you have this little thing you can roll your finger on. It has a little bit of texture. Then you have this. It's really nice. And then you have a switch and a turntable. Then you also have this little kind of lever thingy. Also has texture. And then a little textured spot. Yeah, that's the fidget pad. Then you have this like fidget ring. I think it's like a fidget decompression ring, I think. And yeah, it's, it looks kind of like a gear, but you have a switch. Worry stone. Or like a smooth stone kind of thing. Then buttons that make noise. One that doesn't. And then you have the um, little turntable. You can also kind of use it like a switch. That has that one is my favorite of the three I'll be showing you for the for this part. And then you have little gears you can turn. Then like a little metal ball thing that you can roll. You can also press it in. Then the last thing on this is the joystick, which you can obviously move. You can press it in. Then it also spins like that. And yeah. Then you have the fidget dodecagon. It has this little thingy. I really don't know, but it's fun. If you can be pretty fun. Then yet again, you have a joystick. Then a switch. Smaller than the rest, but it's still really fun. Then you have this little head. It's got a face on it. Move it around, fling it. Then you have these little kind of switches, I guess you would call them. Yeah, they're fun. Then you have a silicone button. Then you have this little textured area. Then you have like little gears. Then you have this, this is the turntable. It's also a button. And you can also like rub your finger on it. It has texture. Yeah, it's pretty fun. Another like soothed stone or smooth stone, whatever. 
then three more faces. Just like this. They're pretty fun. And then the last thing on here is buttons. And yeah, that's the fidgeto deck gone. Here are my poppets. I have a few. First, I'm going to start off by showing my octagon poppet. And this was my first poppet that I ever got, and I love it. It's really cute. Then we have the star poppet. This one, I just really like it so much. It's so cute. I mean, it's shaped like a star. It's adorable. Just pretty. And then we have the square poppet. This one's super fun. And this one has 36 pops, so I like it a lot. Then there's my snail poppet. And it's super cute. It has a very bright, vibrant yellow color. And it's really nice. Then we have my frog poppet. And this is my biggest poppet that I have as of now, and it's an octagon. This one is really nice. I think it has 82 pops on it, like 82 little bubble things, and it's really fun. And both sides on this are super loud, so that's really good. And if you like this video, make sure to drop a like, and I will be posting a part two very soon, and that's just part one. So, yeah, see you next time.